White Sox in search of a fifth straight win and a fifth straight win over Texas. Matt Harrison on the hill for the Rangers, holding the White Sox in check in the early innings until the fourth. Man aboard for Paul Konerko. He drills the two-run homer to left. 17th of the year for Konerko, and the White Sox have a 2-0 lead. Opposing Harrison, Phillip Umber, but facing a two-on, no-out situation in the home half of the fourth, but striking out David Murphy for out number one, and then facing Michael Young. Young grounds into the inning-ending twin killing to end the threat. A chance by the boards for the Rangers as Umber escapes trouble. It's still 2-0 pale hose. Moving to the top of the fifth, Eduardo Escobar at the plate as he promptly drills the Harrison pitch deep to left center field. It will go as an RBI double as Jordan Dank scores. Escobar would be out at third, and he'd soon be out of the White Sox uniform. More on that in a bit. The White Sox now have a 3-0 lead. Let's take it top five. It is Matt Harrison still on the hill facing Adam Dunn with a man aboard. That ball hit high and deep in the center field. Gentry back at the wall. He looks up, jumps, you can. Put it on the board. Yes. Yes. Major League leading 31st homer for Don the White Sox in command. They have a 5-0 lead. Now to the home half of the fifth. Mike Napoli trying to get something going for the Rangers and doing so. The solo shot off Umber to lead off the fifth. Number 16 for Napoli. And the White Sox lead trimmed to 5-1. Another chance for the Rangers. Bottom seven. Runners on the corners. Nobody down. Jesse Crane inheriting those runners from Umber. But he strikes out Leonis Martin on a foul tip for out number one. And then it's Craig Gentry who goes down on strikes. And now it's Ian Kinsler trying to salvage the inning for the Rangers. That change up hit into left field. Tank coming on and makes a catch. Yes! What a beautiful sliding, diving catch by the Seattle. The White Sox stay red hot. They go on to win 5-2 as Phillip Umber improves to 5-5 five five on the season. Matt Harrison falls to 12-6 as the White Sox improve to 6-2 versus Texas and have now won five games in a row over the two-time defending AL champs. And more big news for the White Sox after this one as they acquire starting pitcher Francisco Liriano from Minnesota in exchange for the aforementioned infielder Eduardo Escobar and left-hand pitcher Pedro Hernandez.